Hey Raiders, it's Mrs. Earwood and Mr. Angle. We have some important messages for you about this upcoming week. <laughs> Number one, tomorrow night we have our open house from 6 to 8. Great time for you to come out and meet your teachers with your parents, uh, go over your syllabus, just how to get in touch with your teachers when you need them, and show off our school. So we hope everyone comes to our open house tomorrow from 6 to 8. Let me talk a little bit about how open house will work. You'll come in, you'll, there'll be a kind of check-in in the front, or just a scan code so you can scan and get credit for checking in. And then you just go around to the classes as you choose. There's not a set schedule or anything like that. We want you to show your parents around the school and make sure that you take them to meet each of your teachers. A couple other things, just quick reminders. We have no school for students this Friday and next Monday, so a four-day weekend for everyone. However, if you do owe hours from last semester for attendance recovery, we are having Saturday school this Saturday from 8 to 12. So if you need to recover your attendance, make sure you're here this Saturday from 8 to 12. I want to go over a couple things about map testing this week. Uh, it's kind of an additional uh, mandatory state test that we need to take, and it really does uh, matter. So we're really looking closely at these scores and data points we get from students. But I want you to just go over all the things that we need to make sure kids are doing to be successful. Okay, uh, map testing is, uh, once again, in four subjects, Algebra 1, Geometry, Algebra 2, and the Biology test is actually taking place right now. Um, we did have a lot of students this morning without Chromebooks. It is really important that you guys remember to bring your charged Chromebook. Charged. Um, charged, charged. I have only a handful of extras for chargers and Chromebooks to lend out. We did run out today, so please bring your stuff this week if you are in those classes. Um, also, next week we will have some makeup testing for those of you that did not get to test today or if you were absent, so be looking forward to that. Um, also, this test is something to take seriously. Your teachers get a lot of really valuable data from you guys so that they know where you're at and what they can help you with. It's also gonna help us measure your growth and help us prepare you for the STAR test for at least the algebra and the biology. So do your best. And it's replacing our benchmarks. So people are like, oh my gosh, we're doing more testing. Actually, this is the in replacement of some of right. the tests we've given in the past. Right. Again, it gives us really good data. It allows us to better prepare you for success on the STAR EOC. So parents, please make sure that you're working with your child to understand the importance of this week. Now, if you're not STAR testing, you know, when they come in in the mornings, they check for their name on the wall to see mm -hmm. where their testing assignment is. If the room's been relocated and they're in the auditorium, they need to make sure they check in prior to going in the auditorium. We'll have a check-in station, attendance station right outside the auditorium. So make sure you do that. But again, it's really important. You don't want to lose attendance this week because you're not in the right place. Make sure if you have any questions, you see one of the adults in the hallway and we can make sure we help you. So an important week, a lot of, lot of good data for us this week. Um, congratulations to our football team opening the season with a 20 to six win over Waco High. Congratulations to them. The thing I was most excited about, obviously we won, but what a great turnout and student pride and, and student section. I hope that we can continue to have a student section throughout uh, the next coming weeks at our game. And just, again, building school pride because if we have pride in what we're doing and we take a lot of pride in our school, we're going to be very successful here at Southwest. So until next time, go Raiders. Go Raiders.